This church closed its doors to you a long time ago. Your presence is no longer welcome. I know how you feel. The church fed me as well. That's why we're all here. Expulsion from the Church of England, discharged from the army, or just plain poor. Which one are you? I know. The Church of England expelled you because you didn't fit into the established order of things. There is another option to you. You could always start your own church. I can study the Bible with you. What's your name? Elizabeth. But you can call me Beth. Now we're husband and wife. Dearest, is something the matter? I'm looking forward to reading your finished manuscript. Maybe I can help you with your work. No. This is something I have to do alone. You don't love me. You've never loved me. You just want a wife to appear respectable. Beth, you know that's not true. Then prove it. Prove to me that you love me. I married you, didn't I? What other proof do you need me to show you? Your head is full of books and useless knowledge that's not helping you to write and is interfering with our marriage. What are you asking me to do? I need a child, Robert. I need something of you that I can cherish while you're lost in this world of books. I can't stand in the way of your writing. Then I need something else of you that I can hold on to in your physical and emotional...
As you know, this is where I spend most of my time. I can read the scriptures aloud to you whilst you work on your commentary. Yes. I should think a little reading in Hebrew might be well. Breishit bara Elohim hehashamayam wihaharetz. In the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. 